Hello, welcome back to Hand of Fate. Let's try the moon again. I've changed a couple of encounters here. Okay, Odi by Iron and the Goblin Town. Yes, 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 because if I'm correct, we somehow need to get three more uh, people to move us. So I think we can get the grave digger. The um, final chapter of our story approaches. The cards um, are set in motion. Right, the, I think, the baker, the thing moved to the open early by us. Oh no, we can leave them only after they died. Hmm. Okay, I guess we will. Search up all these. Oh, oh, come on, Drew. Because there's lots of dice numbers. Like I said. Treat the hug with a kiss. Mm. Take a bite. Bite. A bite. Cake. And. Enter the post of war. And denounce the empire. The crowd regards your speech with suspicion. They are sure to alert the empire. A single member of the audience, a woman in the judge's upcoming looks inspired by her speech. Hope that old Batman is happy with your performance. Eh. Yeah. Of course. We need 50 gold for the apothecary. Apothecarian! So, because we he has two bottles of antidote as well. Need those. And the reason why I did this maze is because we are going to follow the old lady into the pit. And if I am correct, we will try to break from that. And this time it will all go faster since I won't be reading all of the 
all the packs to be encountered. Sorry. Search for spoils. Gold, please, if gold. Get me. Yep, yep. Need the gold mountains from the goblins. God damn it! Yes, yes, please give me your. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> This is going great. Hey! Oh. So. This one? Yep. Sure. Not that I have any other choice. We don't have cold brew with us. Seriously. Fine, I'm famous. No, give that back. I need it. Raiders.
Now, what can you give me? Remains? Please? God damn it. Death comes mm. as a surprise even to those awaiting it. I can tell you this with confidence. No Imperial armor. Already recognizable. Great. It would be perfect if we had 100. 100. Uh, yeah. 100 gold. That's why I'm glad that we can leave. I can't deal with them all. Symmetry. Okay, now, and over here is Goblin Town, finally. Great. See, there's the heaping pile of gold, and with a side pulls a large crate out from behind the counter. Inside, you see dozens of small bottles of amber liquid. Here, take them. I never claimed this was a cure, but desperate times make desperate people. Okay, and both of them. What can I buy now? No, oh, I don't want the armor. Go for anything else? Yes. <laughs> it shuffles spoons less. Alright, all I need. Give me a second. Stay calm. Okay, just try to sneak. This helps a lot. Helping her. What the? What's going on? Come on. If you'll be so kind. Oh my god. So we fight. Oh well. Remember, 12 finishers? I think it was. Or 12. Maybe 12. Maybe 12 times? Oh. 
Maybe it was still yeah. because of the wall. Well, at least we will... Maybe we'll get the shard. But we're not getting grabbed. into the tomb it is dark here and unusually warm. You take a tentative step through the smooth marble underfoot. The air smells of dust and flowers. You see a small shrine of dust and flowers and forgotten candle. There are tunnels to the east and the west. It's the west. The path leads to a small room with a pile of blankets and pillows set in the corner. A crack in the tomb's roof bathes in warm sunlight. You are suddenly overcome with exhaustion and with nothing more than sink into the silken feathers. Head east. 
In the depths of the tomb, you are overcome by a feeling of dread. There is a scuffing sound behind you, and you have to swim. And you should uh, cast down the tunnels. A statue of rope to may stand in the intersection, watching with full eyes. West. We are at the inner sanctum. A diving pit lies at the center of the room, swallowing the light. Well, someone, the old widow who appears behind you. Why, hello! Did you get lost? With a long smile, well, healed plants your bundle of dried flowers. She knows encouragingly and stands back to look. Okay, give me a second because I don't want to screw them Place them next to the hole. Gently place the petal flowers on the floor next to the pit. The old widow smiles back at you, her wrinkled face wet with tears. You hear a scream of terror from somewhere above ground. Hills hide smooth smile and stay that she must stay here a while to pray. Unnerved, you quickly retrace the steps of the tomb. You find a source of the screaming. It's none other than the great old grave digger Thomas. Daughter! He's here! He bubbles, pointing a shaking hand at the mouth of ornate tombs. Search in the pointed direction. You rush up the stairs to confront the threat. A hulking mass slides out from behind a mausoleum. The faceless creature who towers over you, its free eyes shining violently. That reason a bit. You hear yourself shout and rumble in all the towns you know. That's actually possible. Nope. <laughs> Unless. A win here sets the tone for your challenge. The water appears unmoved by a bubbling until you utter the word blood, at which point its black shimmering mass flickers and it is suddenly gone. Thomas sweeping taps his forehead uncontrollably and juggles force of gratitude. How must the great digger produce his service to your cause? Carry Thomas to his cottage near the cemetery's entrance. You have to ply him with tea and walls of comfort before he loses his fearful grip on your hand and allows you to leave. So again, the blades. So we have to go through here again. It's always on the far left. And once I pick the far left, it's not gonna be there. Anyway, we're getting the shard. So there was no wave after all. Oh well. Oh, I'm the puppy. I will remove your curse. I have no blessing. Sorry! always on the far left.
you know, no matter how which way I go, I will just end up with checking all those posts. Mm, happy to go into the craft bow. Explore. Breathe. You have done well. I know. Explore. Get the second guy. Explore. Again, because we need to go to the school. That will set you in good stead from here. Find the source of the laughter. Oh my goodness. The pendulum is ever changing, and the challenges it presents change too. Mm. Leave the party leave. No surprise, I wanted to just leave it be, but. Change your weapon. <laughs> oh. Escape the ball. I decrypted and I have to fight them alone. God damn it. And I have two minutes for it. <laughs> but there's no dragon now, so it should be easy enough. I hate it. <laughs> I hate it so much. But we made it. We have all of them. Can I turn back? No. Okay. I just want to go through. And we are done with the moon.
need to find our way out. Oh no, I didn't want to do this. Oh, I just need to get through the Empire Soldier. I have no idea who I am. I'm just from random Toshna. It's always on the far left. Just, we'll just trade curse for curse. Where the hell is it? I wanna leave. On the third option, I wanna leave. <laughs> Item. That you can give it to me. Sure. <laughs> if it's if the exit is on that one card that I have that, that so I would rather go here. Yeah, it's not. Can I leave? No. <laughs> I just wanna leave here. to jump. Leave. 
Mehmet. Leave me alone. Oh. I don't care. Damn it. <laughs> it moved. How could you? Get the head. I thought you got rid of this guy. Hey, 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 I keep hitting the microphone. I'm sorry. Some how reviews about pledge to your cause. Then how chuckles as he reads the list. Oh, Pantan wishes the Emperor dead. Why well, you have done well indeed. Suddenly a troop of Emperors burst into the terrace. A chained ogre trudging behind them. The soldiers release the chains and the ogre shudders, its yellow eyes darting around wildly. Some unknown condition prevents him from trying to escape. General Flinthal draws his sword. Stand down, man. One of the grubby looking soldiers growls. Flynn, how you traitor! Call the name of the assassin! May your death be slow and painful. Draw your weapon.
as the last enemy falls, Flint Hall is already cleaning his sword and walking swiftly toward the exit. Without breaking stride, he details the way into the palace. The sewers by the western docks, a gate edged with a burnt sun, may find passage into the palace there. Gather your companions, mercenary, prepare for the fight of your life. Tomorrow you kill the Emperor. Your mastery of the game is impressive. I have trained you well. Okay. <laughs> yeah, and that's it for today. Tomorrow we go for justice. For now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!